This is the energy vibration lays in for the Sagittarian Sun, Moon, and Rising sign, and um, for you Sagittarians, um, this um, word as their positive, positive um, um, vague to convince it. Um, I want to. I want to say thank you for the support of this channel. Thank you for the wonderful positive energies that has um, come in. Um, um, for you Sagittarians this is um, the general energy of the week is a water energy with the energy of the hurt the energy of the work hurt is bringing you stability um, there is um, um, conflicts and that sort of a thing you are going to win a conflicts and um, winning this conflicts you're going to have a situation with the knight of swords this is an energy from someone between the ages of 25 and 45 that is coming at you with um, um, uh, words and eightfold things and this sort of a thing but not to worry you have the energy of the Sun in this week and this is so good for you Sagittarius because the Sun comes out over you you have the energy of the Sun in this week and then you have the energy of the world and the stars so this is a positive week for you Sagittarians another positive reading because this week energies has been so transforming please um, listen to your Sun Moon and Rising sign please like share these videos and thumbs up okay if you are new to my channel and I want to say Happy New Year to um, um, all the people in um, in uh, Ireland and Scotland um, Happy New Year <laughs> and um, to all my the, the Sagittarians people who ask for reading um, Happy New Year to you guys I'm wishing you really wonderful um, this year is good because um, thing there has moved out of the zodiac energy of the um, out of the birth chart of the Sagittarians and this is going to be positive and um, for you Sagittarians who were born um, November 19 November 19 for Sagittarius that was born um, November 29 till December 25th so the Sagittarians who were born between November 29 and um, December um, 17 please listen also to the option um, the new the 13 um, the 13 the um, sign that is the obsolete um, uh, the, the 13 sign because that's who you are okay so the 13th sign because if you realize from January and with the um, year reading you are specified so you're taken out so for the Sagittarians who were born from November 29 till December um, 18 you need to um, to look at this uh, situation okay so let's move forward and let's um, look at what is happening this is going to be good so let's see what is happening okay um on Monday you have the energy of the Knight of Wands in reverse this is this can be um, for some people um, okay um, for some people if you are a man but or a woman between the ages of 25 and 45 Monday is not a good day for you there's a situation that is transpiring um, you're not going to feel as energy um, directed as uh, the rest of the people okay so okay for the rest of the older folks and the younger one um, who is younger than 24 till zero um, and the folks who are over 45 and older then um, your energy is going to be you're going to be feeling the energy of the Sun and this is going to be good um, it is um, a fire sign on Tuesday a wonderful day one is one of your best days whatever you decide to do on Tuesday go for it um, it's a yes it's a go on Tuesday it's going to be the end of a cycle in your life and a new cycle is about to begin okay on Wednesday you have the energy vibration of the four of swords and whatever the situation is but the energy of the four of swords um, it is a time when you need um, to um, relax on Wednesday whatever is happening whatever is transpiring you need to relax you need to balance out your energy and this is going to be positive as we move forward we have the energy of the star 
whatever um, is happening on Thursday it is going to be another good day you have the energy of the star it's a wonderful day stay positive it said yes so on Tuesday and Thursday in this week it's going to be one of your best day and the energy of the star comes out and this is going to be very very positive so whatever is transpiring on Thursday it's going to be good on Friday you have win a battle whatever this battle was it can be in a in, in a, like conflicts or it can be a battle with other people you have won this battle because here you have the energy of the Sun as your energy vibration for the week and you have two three major arcana that is coming up the energy of the Sun that is vitalizing and refreshing and bringing a new stuff in and the energy of the world that is ending a cycling a, a opening a new cycle and the energy of the star and this is a positive energy with the energy of the star because the energy of the star is bringing positive energy um, towards you and this is ending a battle so as we move forward we have the knight of swords and energy of the knight of swords is someone who's coming at you um, with um, information and a sort of a negative thing that is happening around you and um, it's not to worry you um, not to worry we're going to look and see who is this person because I obviously have win a battle against this person you have win a battle against this person and this is going to be good okay as we move forward we have the energy of the two of Pentacles whatever this situation is for the energy of the two of Pentacles it is in the reverse form the energy of the star is over you that means whatever your um, your emotional and financial emotion because I'm getting a more a situation of your emotion it's as if something happened and some situation has been taking place and you're now balancing out your emotions let's see what is happening for the night and the world you are seeing a situation very clearly okay so um, for you people between the ages of 25 and 45 you're seeing a situation clearly there is light that is coming out over a situation you are seeing a situation clearly there's information and situation that's are happening and um, there is um, um, light that is coming out over a situation you're seeing something for what has transpired as we move forward and we look at the energy of the world because the cycle is ending a new cycle is about to begin and you have the energy of uh, the um, night of um, you have the energy of the night of cups uh, coming um, towards you and be aware of this night of cups okay this Knight of Cups is it has the energy. It can be um, a man, but it can be a woman that is between the ages of 25 and 45. And what is happening is that this person is a charmer. Be careful of this person. This person is very um, slippery. He's a charmer. Um, he is a Casanova. He is coming to charm you um, between in this week. It can happen um, the evening of a Tuesday. Or it can happen Wednesday Tuesday or Wednesday be um, aware of this charm and this person this person is not very honest um, he knows that he has done certain things and he's coming back and charm his way back in your life and you need to, um, to put a stop to this and um, hold this person off and it's it's um, it's gonna be very very hard for some of you because it's your child I'm seeing a situation that is affecting a parent and their child that this child has done something and he's trying to charm his way back in your life and you're not supposed to let him do that um, you need to stand your ground because obviously I'm seeing a situation that he has done something that was very illegal and injustice to you and he's coming back trying to charm himself in your life don't do it um, you need to stand back and uh, um, old this off sometimes um, um, this is um, love um, you can always love and have a strong love but whenever your child has done something illegal you should never go with it and you can um, um, and trust and um, um, you can um, um, protect your child to a certain um, stage and a certain but there is time when you stand back and you move away from this situation okay so let's look and see what is happening with the rest being 
uh, you have a strong foundation you have a very very strong foundation so whatever is happening you have absolutely a strong foundation because you're resting and you're taking um, you're seeing a situation there's another message that is coming up and I'm going to but whatever is happening you're resting on Wednesday Wednesday uh, between Wednesday and Thursday you're resting Thursday this information this situation is going to be coming out okay and this is what is going to be happening is that you have a strong foundation and the energy of the star is going to come out okay so let's move forward and let's look and see what is happening what is happening um, for you winning a battle and this person is coming at you is that there were um, there is conflicts there is going to be huge huge conflicts because there's a conflict between um, a situation that has been happening there's a lot of lies and a lot of deception lies and deception and this lies and deception is coming um, at you from um, something that this um, person the Knight of Cups has done there is a lot of deception a lot of deception open up your eyes this and I'm seeing this some a woman out there a woman a man or a woman out there is very very um, distort um, and distort meaning that you're so upset um, it's, it's past it's beyond the heartbreak it is um, something that you realize that your own child have done against you and this could be that your child use your name for something that your child has done something to you and you are past um, heartbreak so it is and then because of the situation this child has bring you in certain situation that is um, a certain situation that is um, really really brought some conflicts and problem with other people and you are so um, disappointed in what has happened um, your heart is broken and it's as if it's broken up in a thousand pieces which um, can never be repaired um, it is a situation where you have found out that your child or someone between the ages of 25 and 45 who is a Pisces a cancer or a scorpion has done something to you which is in 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 unrepairable and what you can do with this is just to pray and ask for forgiveness ask um, the, the um, karma the Lord of karma for divine intervention ask for forgiveness so you can forgive yourself and you forget can forgive your child um, things when things and it doesn't have to be your child it can be someone who has done you injustice and this person carries the Sun the the, the, the Sun sign of a, a water sign and this is someone 25 it can be a man or a woman it will affect um, different people in different ways it can be a man or a woman between the ages of 25 and 45 who has done you something injustice and as bring a lot of situations in your life okay and let's look at the next energy that is coming up you have the Queen of one this energy of the Queen of one is an energy where you are seeing that um, uh, the king the, the the knight of swords um, is as if this woman comes in um, to help a situation out it's as if this it, it, there is going to be and this um, is you um, because it's the queen so you women obviously a situation is going to affect you women but you have a strong strong foundation what is going to happen is that um, whatever that has been done against you and uh, against you um, you are going to be um, on Sunday uh, balance out the emotional um, feelings because it's nothing to do with money about this week it's all about a karmatic situation that came around was it karma was it need karma but you're going to be learning to balance out the situation and you're going to turn your back on a lot of stuff you're going to you you are going to choose because for the women who found out that their um, their 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 kids have done something to them that is unbelievable, um, this is where you reach the breaking point. 
where you're going to um, raise your your frequency and ask the angels and guides to raise your frequency over the situation and stand above it it's going to leave some of you being very cold um, to people it's going to leave some of you being very um, withdrawn in the sense that you are going to uh, go out in society but what has happened to you that your own blood that someone that you have brought in this world have done you such an horrible thing um, you are going to be really really um, looking at this and think oh my god what have I done to make someone who I have I've given birth to, to um, display this sort of an activity against me okay so um, whatever the situation is I would say to you ladies because um, um, the energy of uh, the devil is here so obviously um, there is the energy of the devil comes up because obviously whoever um, this child was that has done you something injustice is working under the influence of the devil that means that um, you're realizing that it's not the child not the person that is doing but it's the energy and the people that he's with and why he has chosen to do something like this to you um, is working is, 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 is being um, pushed with his ego okay it's being pushed with his ego um, this is a situation that is going to affect a lot of you you need to find inner strength um, to deal with a situation especially for you ladies um, um, and then you have the nine of cups your wishes and dreams are going to be coming through and there is going to be um, the wishes and dreams are going to be coming true and there are going to be people who are going to be um, supporting you and, and, and really standing there and supporting you or whatever um, has transpired okay so um, normally <laughs> as you draw your readings are always um, a, a little bit longer but um, this week is going to be a week and it's better that it happened in the beginning of the year and um, my heart goes out to whoever out there that is going to realize the um, something that someone it doesn't have to be your child it could be a niece or a nephew it could be a family member or it could just be a stranger but this person is and uh, I'm getting the energy of a scorpion person that has uh, or a cancer so uh, whoever this person is who have done you this injustice um, you need to find and it's going to be hard because uh, and this is going to come as a shock to certain people you're uh, some of you are going to be dealing with it in um, different kind of ways but for the ladies out there because obviously you're showing up here in the reading with um, the energy of the knight of cups and um, you're ending as a, a cycle you you finally found out something in the beginning of the week everything was clear to you you finally found out something in the beginning of the week not to worry because the energy of the Sun comes over to shine a light and here you had the energy of the hermit that came in to bring um, um, and this is inner wisdom and guidance and and the, and the hermit also bring knowledge information to you that you weren't aware of and the hermit came in in this week to shed light on a situation to let you know what has happened and what has transpired and this um, you are uh, feeling remorse unhappiness um, you are so taken back that this would have happened so this is not for everyone because for the rest of the people who doesn't have to deal with a situation it's a positive week because um, the energy of the Sun bringing out and ending a situation bringing a new situation in your life the energy of the star comes out on Thursday and what is happening you have here and you're seeing certain aspect that is coming um, this is a good energy that comes up because obviously it is a week your crown chakra you have to open up your crown chakra and go within and it says I know I am part of source and my life is 
um, guided by the divine wisdom okay I know that I'm part of source and my life is um, um, divinely guided by divine wisdom I um, it is very important that you know these people and you said it I know I'm part of source and my life is guided by divine wisdom okay please say this it is so and it will be um, please say this and um, I'm sorry for whoever out there that this has transpired and this has happened to it is not one of the easiest thing I think the best way to heal the situation is call in um, the angels of um, um, the Lord of Karma and the angels and the Lord of Karma to come in and to deal with this situation okay ladies and gentlemen it's kind of sad but um, for the rest of you it's gonna be wonderful because you have the world and the star energy and the Sun so it's gonna be a wonderful week for the rest of the people who doesn't have and been affected by this situation okay um, I want to say listen to your Sun Moon Horizon sign and a Namaste